last train Life's going straining just to catch a glance Raining in everything I left behind To catch a glimpse of moment Picture stars and trees and clear blue sky Before they pass forgotten treasures Exit the corner of my eye Life's just the same game when I play shot I'm here to stay but chalk boys and candy canes They can all be erased Holding on to something, nothing in the end What will I even gain? Thankful for the little things, the living hope, the forgotten dreams. You've gotta try to catch that light. Don't let it rot from the bitter cavities of life. Grateful for what you have. Don't go somewhere else and don't look back. Stay and receive here, and you will have. Say yes, believe here, and you'll be full. Hey guys, what's up? It's Paige. Welcome back to the vlog. This week's video is going to be my first college week in my life abroad in Copenhagen. So exciting and so weird to say. I'm still like trying to wrap my head around the fact that I'm here and I'm going to be abroad for four whole months, like an entire semester. It's gonna be awesome. I'm so excited and I can't wait to kind of get into a routine, start going to my classes and get to share all that with you guys. I know the last vlog I posted was kind of all over the place with like traveling and like going and exploring and doing stuff. The upcoming vlogs are gonna be a little bit more like routine based, like me actually going to class doing a bit of homework every now and then. Hopefully it's that good college content that you guys like and you wanna see. But yeah, anyway, today is Monday. What is the date? August 29th. It's currently four o'clock in the afternoon. I had a very productive morning. You already saw that. I went to my two classes. I went grocery shopping. I did a whole bunch of stuff. And I had a very unfortunate situation happen with my laptop the other day. So I was editing the vlog that I just posted before this one. And one morning I just opened up my laptop and the entire screen was like glitchy, it looked like water damage or something, and a quarter of the screen was entirely black, and I have no idea how it happened. It's not like I dropped it, I didn't spill anything on it, it just happened out of the blue. So I took it to the Apple store today, and the man there, he was very nice, but he told me, he's like, this looks like it's gonna be expensive, you might as well just buy a new laptop. And I was like, <laughs> I don't have money for that. I think this would have been like a $250 repair if I was in the US, but because I am in Copenhagen, it is definitely gonna cost me a lot more than that. So tragic. Definitely stressing out a little bit about that, but I don't wanna bring down the vibe of this video. But yeah, now that it is four o'clock, I think I'm gonna go down to Liz's room because she's living in the same building as me and try to figure out the laundry situation. It needs to happen soon. I'm out of socks, like entirely. Are we doing laundry today, Liz? We push that one till tomorrow. That's what we said for the last three days. Tomorrow's the day. Okay, update. It's now 6.22 at night. I don't know why I said it like that, p.m. <laughs> Liz and I are definitely gonna make dinner together tonight, whip up something at home probably, but I think we're gonna do that later. Right now I really wanna go for a run because I'm feeling gross and I think a run would do me good and like just clear my head a little bit. to collective consciousness. There is a difference between our identity as individuals and our identity as group members. Think about that. <laughs> Are you thinking about it, Liz? I'm thinking. The consequences of our lives as we often develop our plans. Good morning vlog. This is quiet this morning because it's early. It's like 8 a.m. Our class is at 8.30. So we're mobilizing. My hair looks really stupid. But I made Liz some toast because I knew she probably would forget to eat. <laughs> and now we're gonna walk to class. Today's our yoga, feminism type of class. Hence the yoga pants. Wish us luck. <laughs> Lizzie. <laughs> How was your yoga, Liz? It's post class. Liz and I are sitting outside a little cafe. We got some lunch. It's good times. I got wasabi covered peanuts in their fire. <laughs> And then we're gonna go to our communications class. Probably not as fun as our yoga class. It is also a three hour block. 
Yeah, got some coffees to um, get us through the day. And then we have uh, like a house dinner. It's called Haig or Heig or? Haiga. Haiga? It's Haiga. I don't know, it's something like that, that we all sit down and eat dinner with everyone that we live with. So that's what we're doing today. currently 148. Um, basically I just went to my class this morning. I walked to class. I had one at 8 30 and then I like read a book and took a little nap in the lounge for like an hour and a half and then I went to my other class, my Danish language class. So I just walked back to my apartment. It is an absolutely beautiful day outside. I don't know if you can see this. You can't but trust me it is. So I think I'm going to make some lunch real quick with just some groceries I have in the fridge right now at home. What I've been making for like the past couple days every day for lunch. I just buy like a huge bag of kale at the grocery store using our stipends and then this like pre-made bulgur rice which is so cheap it was like 30 kroners which is like nothing and then I just make a salad a little every day put some hummus in there super filling super cheap trying to save money because as you know my laptop is broken and I handed that in on Monday at the Apple store for them to fix it and I followed up yesterday to see like what was going on with that. And they just told me this morning that it should be ready by tomorrow if the repairs go smoothly. Really, really nervous about that. I wanna get that laptop back so badly. It has all my editing software on it. It's just really throwing me off my game. I need my laptop back. But yeah, that was my quick little rant. Um, it's 14.03 right now, so about two o'clock. I'm gonna enjoy the salad, rest, relax a little bit, and then I'll probably head outside because it's such a beautiful day. It's officially the weekend, so Liz and I are celebrating. We're gonna pay for our entire meal in coins. <laughs> hey, babes. You're so cute. Well, just letting you know you're not supposed to film in here. It's 2117, so 917. Killed it. This is my little outfit. Looking like a. Fancy little bean. Where's the top from? Lizzie's closet. It says Polly and Converse. G -g -g. Anyway, we're gonna have a really good night. Bye bye. Taking the metro. Taking the metro. It's like 11 in the morning right now, a little later maybe. Just woke up, last night was a lot of fun. But it's a great day today because I don't have any classes and it's Friday, which is amazing. So I got to sleep in, which is nice because usually during the week I have my 8.30 classes. So it was so nice not having to wake up at 8.30 today. It's the small things in life, really. I think I'm gonna do some homework for a little bit. And yeah, we're just gonna take it slow today. It's gonna be an easy, relaxing Friday. All right, so I'm now doing my makeup because I'm actually gonna go meet a friend for lunch. Her name's Jessie. I just met her like a week ago. She's really sweet. That's the new plan. I was really looking forward to being lazy in bed all day, but this is probably better for my mental health. I should probably step outside today. So I'm gonna do that. <laughs> 
Just attempting to make myself look a little bit better. But it's pretty awesome that I never have classes on Fridays because that means that every week is a three-day weekend for me, which is dangerous, but fun. Just gotta find a way to enjoy that without blowing all my money. <laughs> I'm oh, sorry, should I be explaining like what I'm doing? I've been using this Clinique powder. It's like a translucent powder when I don't feel like putting makeup on my face, which is almost never. Like sometimes I'll put concealer on if I'm going out, but if not, if it's just every day to class or something, I use this stuff. And it's like transparent, but not totally. It gives you like a little bit of coverage and color. Love that stuff. And I'm also like super oily all the time, so it works great. And then on my brows, I usually just brush them through with this brow gel. This is the Gimme Brow by Benefit. And then this is my favorite mascara right now. This is the Lights Camera Lashes by Tarte. My mom put me on this stuff and it's so good. Love it. I'm gonna be so sad when I run out of it. I'm gonna make some funny faces now while I put this on. And that's the mascara. And then I finish it off with some chapstick. Real fancy up in here. Um, I would do like bronzer and a lot of other stuff if I was going out, but I'm just going to lunch, so. That's my little everyday makeup routine. Oops. Hope you guys enjoyed. I know you were dying to know what products I use. Now it's time to pick out the outfit. This is where I keep my clothes. Why am I doing an accent? I don't know. Okay, last step, we got some earrings. Put it on the hoops. Lovely, here's the fit. I don't know if you guys can really see this, but. I look a, a little bit like I'm going to a business meeting, but. Okay, I'm gonna go to lunch. It's not over, no, it's only just begun. I used to have a way with words, but now I trip over my tongue, yeah, yeah. game. Got my little sporty hat on, albeit for the wrong sport, but I'm trying. Up, I guess. Made it to the stadium. Gonna get a hot dog. Number one priority, because we're starving. To the outro. I'm sorry I didn't get a lot of clips on Friday night. We just went to that soccer game and then I ended up going home right after. You didn't miss much, trust me. I'm currently eating this apple. We walked into my Danish class this morning. It's the next week, by the way. And my Danish teacher was like, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. And she gave us all little apples that she grew in her own backyard. Like, isn't that the cutest thing ever? Anyway. That was a pointless story. Basically, I just want to say thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you liked it and enjoyed seeing some of my routine and my day-to-day -day going to classes and stuff. There should be a lot more exciting vlogs coming up. We have a bunch of trips, me and my friends, planned for the next month or so. So I'm going to be doing lots of travel vlogs, lots of school, lots of classes, just lots of vlogs in general. So stay tuned for that. I love you guys all so much. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.